Hi everybody, it's Lynn from Lynn's Crafts Designs. I'm coming by today with another unboxing. Um, this one is for BB Craft. At first, I um, I sent a mes message to Lisa because some of these I won't say they were damaged, but I know other people have complained that they get they get these molds that are out of shape. Okay, so one of the solutions <laughs> this is just a piece of foam core board. <laughs> it's that simple, literally. I cut this one actually for Wait, wait, wait. No. Hold on. I actually cut this one. Yeah. Nope. Okay. I actually cut this one for... I cut this out of the big sheet. And the hole that I cut this out of fits the lid because the lid was terribly misshapen. It has already corrected itself quite a bit. Just needs to be in there. Uh, because this shape is very important. Now, it, it doesn't fit on the uh, open side. It fits on this side. So, the round of this one is it's okay but the round on this one I wanted it to fit I want it to fit so I am sorry I'm doing it again just ranting and rambling just to say how easy it is to solve the problem okay so anyway uh, the set of four little, um, man, I don't even know what they're called. If these are supposed to be for tea lights, they won't fit the electric ones. I don't know about the regular tea lights, but they won't fit the electric ones. So, tiny little pots. <laughs> they're really, really cute. And I can use them like crazy on my desk because I all the time have tiny little things that need a container. As you can see. Huh? This one is blue. This one is yellow glitter with a... Let's see. I did this one with a yellow resin dye and then while it was curing before it was um, mm -hmm, before the work time was over I dropped just a couple of drops of red I know you won't be able to see it on the camera but got a really there I'll be able to see it okay and then lastly but not least well not lastly um this Mm -hmm. Really cute. 
cute box. Circular box, square box. Egg box. Now this one, this one will require some extra work. This was the first pouring that I did. I love it. I love how it looks like an egg with yolk all over it. Okay, but as you can see, because, because you can't pour this and have it have a natural egg shape at the top, it has to have somewhere to actually pour in at, alright? So this one will require a bit of sanding off. <laughs> Boy, you have any idea how hard sanding resin can be. But luckily I do have a, um, mm -hmm, a bench grinder, so hopefully I can get that off there. Um, just give it a rounded so so cute I mean once again just as a container sitting on your desk that is really cute really cute so I love how the the chunky glitter itself has a it's a chunky fine glitter mix plus I actually did several anyway I did several different glitters and then I did allow the glitter the glitter the resin to set up um I probably should have poured um, maybe just a little thin layer with the chunky glitter just so that it followed the zigzag a little bit better but still the um, finer glitter is suspended in the resin it's really cute all right, I'll hush now, I promise. <laughs> so cute. Thank you to BB Craft um, for sending me all these wonderful goodies. Um, I will be doing a couple of demos, of course. Um, these don't count. Trust me. I was just... I couldn't stand not doing anything, being offline for so long. So I had to give them a try. So, alright. I'll leave the links down below. Um, Y'all should know the drill by now. Um, like I said, thank you to BB Craft. The links to everything will be listed below. Um, the links to my social media will be listed below. Thank y'all so much for watching, and bye for now. Okay, sorry about that. I also got from BB Craft. Um, these are two sets of the, this is the larger puppets, and this is the smaller puppets with some of the little spoons and finger cotton. I got two sets of finger cots. Okay. I also got a set of these. I don't know what they're made out of. Um, measuring cups. Okay. Sorry, I've already used the other one. <laughs> it's got water and paintbrushes in it. This was the thing that I was really most excited about. And you're probably asking yourself, why? This is 
it's a mountain okay that that really sounds kind of plain but here we go you could do white resin in the bottom and then a clear left that cure and then a clear maybe translucent blue okay and then turn that out an icy mountain oh that would be so pretty okay here we got red resin then a gray not left that cure then a gray or a black resin volcano white resin let it cure same thing gray resin let it cure regular mountain i'm telling you the possibilities with this are endless i'm sure y'all have seen those the resin trays that people are doing with like to put on your vanity or imagine it with um jewelry or with nail polish or something to that effect a little tray with a different mountain okay or a mountain with two of those little deer really and truly so many possibilities with this thing oh, i'm really excited about it i'm gonna say again i always i always save the plastic bags that come in because silicone is like a magnet and i have the world's hairiest dog oh yes i do and if anybody wants to talk about how hairy their dog is I am sympathetic because I just finished sweeping my craft room and yes I mean sweeping it I have carpet but you have to sweep before you can vacuum because of the dog hair I'm telling you it gets everywhere husky German Shepherd mix Hmm. Hairy. Very hairy. Alright, once again, y'all. Thank y'all so much for watching. <laughs> I promise to leave the links to everything down below. If I can remember everything. Thank you to BB Craft. Thank you, Lisa. Um... I'm glad, I'm glad I sorted everything out because I didn't want to not use them. They're too cool. That is, I'm sorry, that is awesome. I just love it. I, I am in love. Egg yolk vibes all over it. Alright, I'm going to quit talking now, I promise. Um, yeah, I'll leave the links down below to everything. Uh, my social media links are listed below as well. Thank y'all so much for watching. Bye for now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Here's what I was talking about. If I can remember everything. I'm not sure which kit this was included with. But. Um, it's a collection of, there are opalescent glitters. Oh, all of them are opalescent glitters, except for the gold, the silver, and, okay, this is a yellow gold, and this is, a, 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 I don't know, but really useful. I've got um, several of these, and they do come in handy for certain things, so. Alright. 
promise I'm done now. I promise.